Oxyrhynchus. Oxyrhynchus, meaning sharp snooted fish, in ancient Greek, was a bustling city that thrived along the banks of the Nile River in Upper Egypt. This ancient city is located roughly 160 kilometers to the southwest of Cairo. Founded around 332 BC after Alexander the Great's conquest of Egypt, the city was known by its Egyptian name, Permedjade, meaning, House of the Fish God. During the Hellenistic period, Oxyrhynchus blossomed into a major regional capital, becoming the third largest city in Egypt. It boasted grand structures and served as a center of trade and culture. While no grand temples rival those of Luxor or Karnak survive today, Oxyrhynchus possessed significant religious sites. Several temples dedicated to Egyptian deities like Thoth, the god of wisdom, and Isis, the goddess of motherhood, graced the city. As Christianity spread through Egypt, Oxyrhynchus became a prominent center of the faith, dotted with churches and monasteries. The true treasures of Oxyrhynchus lie not in stone monuments, but rather in the vast trove of papyri unearthed here. For centuries, the city's inhabitants discarded everyday documents, literary works, and religious texts on massive rubbish dumps located on the fringes of the city. The dry desert climate miraculously preserved these papyri, offering a window into the lives of ordinary people, religious beliefs, and literary works from ancient Egypt. The discovery of these papyri began in the late 19th century and continues today. These documents, written in Greek, Latin, and even ancient Egyptian, Demotic, have provided invaluable insights into the Greco-Roman world, early Christianity, and even lost fragments of classical literature. Oxyrhynchus, though its physical structures may not stand as tall as other Egyptian cities, holds immense significance for our understanding of the ancient world.